Zika came to Australia in 1969, lured here for his engineering skills that were in demand. He's worked on many things since then, but this solar-powered electric van is his pride and joy. I have one kilowatt of solar panels, which charges the mine battery, and mine battery, they're here. I have a 1500, 1500, and then 5,000 here. All uh, lithium batteries are from pair tools and uh, laptop, and I recycle them. At the moment, there's 8,000 in the car. His car can go 200 kilometres on one charge. While he's never done a full road trip in it, he says he has never run out of charge on a single trip. Charging is coming direct from the roof. There are three little 10 horsepower DC motors. They use them for lawn mowers. 20 years ago, Mr Dorkick covered his roof in solar panels that he got from a collapsed manufacturer. Since then, he hasn't paid for power for his home or for fuel for his car. I've got solar panels all over house, shed, garage, everywhere. So I've got so much energy that I can supply both neighbours. He says he made the car out of concern for the environment. He wants to see more people drive solar-powered cars like his to get away from fossil fuels. Definitely, we, we have to go as soon as possible, immediately out of fossil fuel. Look at it, you know, we got this unusual heat, we got, we got rain, we got floods, uh, like especially in Europe, you know, they don't get proper snow. Uh, everything is upside down. More Australians are purchasing electric vehicles every year as more affordable options come onto the market. But while not everyone has the skills to build their own, Mr Dorkick wants to inspire people and make them think about using solar to power their own ride. People should, you know, take this example. Every house should have a car like that. 